A Muslim woman files an official complaint stating her religious freedoms were violated after a traffic stop by Ferndale police. The Council on American Islamic Relations, or CARE, filed the claim on her behalf today. 7 Action News reporter Faraz Javed has the dash and body cam footage that's at the center of this fight. I can just see myself there. And it's not it's what they wanted to do. They wanted to strip me of my, my crown. My job. We believe that she was racially profiled by the Ferndale Police Department while they were in the city of Detroit for a targeted uh, stop. A traffic stop that Helena Bow says traumatized her. She was stopped on eight mile near Woodward by two Ferndale police officers. Bow's attorney, Amy Ducare, says the stop captured on dash cam was unconstitutional. They ran her plates and told her that allegedly they thought her plates were expired. Ducare says Bo was eventually arrested for carrying a taser and according to Ferndale Police Department, one needs a permit to carry the weapon legally, which Bo did not. However, Bo says her ordeal got worse when she got to the station and was forced to remove her abaya and a search was conducted by a male officer. Our client pleaded with the female officer to please search her, uh, stating that it was against her religion for this man to be touching her, and the female officer did not take that into consideration at all. Ducare says following the search, Bo was coerced to remove her hijab for a booking photo. The female sergeant came in and said that, you know, her hijab could not be removed under any circumstances because it was a religious right of hers to wear it, and then proceeded to tell her, I know you want to go home today. If you want to go home today, you'll take your scarf off so that we can take a booking photo of you without your scarf. Bo says she was violated again on July 8th after arriving to the Ferndale Police Station for arraignment procedures. Bo claims she was searched again by a male officer, but was allowed to keep her hijab on for the booking photo. Um, I feel like it's my shield of armor. Um, I represent who, um, my belief system and who I am. I'm Muslim. So it's, it's very important that I wear hijab. It's like a form of worship for me. Meanwhile, in a statement issued today by the Ferndale Police Department, it reads, in part, the traffic stop and search were conducted ethically and appropriately. Miss Bow was stopped on Eight Mile Road, which, as a shared road between the cities of Ferndale and Detroit, is routinely patrolled by both police departments. And what I want to come out of this is a positive change that Muslim women no longer have to be stripped of their religious beliefs just because they were in the criminal justice system or they were arrested. Ideally, we're looking for um, the city of Ferndale to reach out to us to um, have a, open a dialogue about ways they could have done this better. Now, Ferndale Police Chief Dennis Emmy acknowledges that Miss Bo was indeed asked to remove her hijab for a set of photos, and he will reach out to CARE to discuss how the current policies can be amended to better fit the needs of citizens of Muslim faith, as well as the wider community. Faraz Javid, 7 Action News.